Hi, I'm Mel and welcome back to Vlogmas. I hope you're enjoying my Vlogmas this year and today I'm going to share with you how to make your very own Santa plate or Father Christmas plate that you put out for them each year. Now, if you don't want to make your own, I do sell these. So the link to my shop is down below if you would like to buy one. It may be too late this year, but if it isn't, um, I'm happy to make one unless this goes crazy vi viral then maybe not but next year possibly too so for this all you'll need is a white tea plate like a um, dinner plate you'll need um, ceramic or glass paint and you can get that in pen version too so I've got the sharpie pen version for the writing and then I do all the rest freehand so I hope you enjoy this and I am going to film it now for you, so enjoy. So first of all I work out the letters of the name. I can do up to four names on a plate depending on how long they are. But this is for my best friend's baby because um, this is obviously her first Christmas. I can't find my template what I use each year but I'm going to use, that's too small, I'm going to find a new template. Um, to use for the circles um, but her name's Aurelia and um, my friend can't decide if she's going to be if he's going to be called Santa or Father Christmas so I'm going to go with Santa because all my others are Santa so far so I'm going to be making a few more now but I'm just filming one for you um, and then we're going to go from there so her name's Aurelia I'm going to test out this pen because it's my old pen to see if it works yes it does um, if not, I've got a new one there and I'm going to do it. So, Santa and Aurelia. So, I'm going to get a bit of paper to work that out. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, it's perfect. So, it matches really. So, first of all, on my plate, I'm going to write love. And then up from that, so seven, so it's got to be three. So the middle letters are an A and an E. So an E's got to go here. So I'm going to do Aurelia first, so that's my E for Aurelia. And then directly up from that I'm going to do Santa, so the E should match the A. So this is what it looks like. To Santa, love Aurelia. So this is what basically the writing is. And then I'm going to do the place your drink here, place your mince pie here in the middle. I'm just going to get something to draw around as a template. So using my pencil in this pot, I'm going to just draw around on here, which is my scrapbook bit of paper. It's probably too big but it's a template anyway so I'm just going to get a mark to see if that's better so yeah that's about the right size so I'll cut that out now and this can be my template for this year um, obviously if you're making millions to them this is what you need for each year to so just keep it safe So with the bit of paper you cut out from the bottom of your mug, you need to then like mark around like you would be drawing like dot 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 for the someone to write their name on. So you just hold this in place and with your 
I've been using the gold pen, but you can use whatever colour you mark. The lines. Like this, and then you just go over them after. And then in the middle, you write place um, drink here, and then in the bottom one, you do place mince pies here. Then using the orange paint, mine is just the matte glass. I'm just going to do a squiggle down here to paint into the um, carrot for Rudolph. And then I'm using the green and I'm just going to do a splodge up here to make like the carrot stem stalk a bit. And then going with the green again. Um, I'm just going to do a splodge either side and do like Christmas trees. Obviously this is what I do, you can do different decorations around the sign. So with the green paint, use a cotton wool bud and you can make a holly. So that's now Christmas trees and like the holly leaves done. Um, mostly you need to leave it to dry, but I'm gonna do all the decorations around the edge um, and then do the dots of the holly too. Well, I need to do the red dots for the holly berries, obviously, and on the baubles of the tree, but I'm gonna do all the other direct decorations around the edge now. Obviously you can do whatever decoration you want. This is what I do. Um, and then they're ready to bake once they're dried, basically. So now it looks like this. Obviously the reindeers both need eyes on, but you need to leave it to dry for a while now. Um, just till it, it, the paint is dry basically, then do the two dots on the eyes and then you cook them in the oven for about 19 minutes, 20 minutes at 
um, 180, 200 degrees, just depends on what paint you've got and what it says on the bottle. So yeah, this is my plate. So that is it for today's uh, Vlogmas DIY Santa treat plate, or and Rudolph plate, should I say. So if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Please comment down below what you did or what you do leave for Santa. Um, I always left jam sandwiches. <laughs> Don't know why, but that is what I did. Um, but my niece and nephew both leave mince pies and carrot for Rudolph. And I think they have food that goes outside for the other reindeers too. And I'll see you in tomorrow's. Bye.